across Cakeland. Here is Cake Sports anchor Chris Lilly. The first few games between Wichita State and Houston were nail biters. WSU won three straight by one run in the Lone Star State, but things have taken off for the Shockers recently. It went off with a bang today in the first ever game at Riverfront Stadium, and it was a beautiful day. Jace Kaminska with the start, and he got some help from his defense early on. Andrew Stewart with a nice scoop and throw to start the double play. That got the crowd on their feet. And this took it to a new level. Paxton Wallace takes the ball to deep right field, and that is gone. There you have it. Wallace with the first ever home run inside Riverfront Stadium. Wallace's bomb put the Shockers in front 2 to nothing in the first. Here's that piece of history one more time. Man, you know, it's like, wow, <laughs> that's the best way to put it. When I hit it and I knew it had a, had a good chance of going out and whenever I saw it go over the walls, it was like it was the best feeling ever, especially when the place erupted and uh, with all those people and it, it was incredible. Back to the highlights, Kaminska doing his thing. The Kansas native threw seven strikeouts, which is a career high, and he'd go nine innings. The distance, Kane Kansas stands up. Representing well, and Eric Wedge was impressed with what his freshman pitcher has been able to do. And the Shocker bats weren't done either. Hunter Gibson with a grand slam in the fifth inning, and WSU pours it on, winning 10-1. to That's six straight wins against Houston. This one meant a little more because the Shockers opened up Riverfront Stadium with a win. Love the, the fans of Wichita and the fact that they showed up today and obviously you know, had a great time for, for all nine innings and great support of us. And, you know, I thank the, the wind surge for getting this opportunity here. It was incredible. We definitely heard them the whole time. So it was, it was awesome just having, having that kind of noise after, after every big play and every big swing. And, man, we, we enjoyed it. That's what those, those are the games you live for. Oh, I thought the uh, stadium was super nice, uh, especially us being the first team to play there and me being the first pitcher. Uh, it, it's just kind of cool. Like, I mean, you don't really think about it, but I never thought I would – Going into this game, I knew we were playing here, but I didn't know that I would be the one throwing the game. And how about Jace Kaminska? He's the first Shocker freshman to throw a nine-inning complete game since 2009. And that's not all either. He tossed a career-high seven strikeouts and improves to 3-0 as a starter. We're starting to come together. Like, pitching's stepped up a lot. Uh, position guys are getting timely hits. And, uh, um, like, any big play in the field, we're making them. Not a lot of errors, just playing baseball. Used all of his pitches. You know, he had good misses. You know, he was able to pitch up and, you know, move his fastball around. His changeup was good to left handers. He's dropping the breaking ball in here. Um, you know, when he missed up, he, he fixed it right away. So uh, a great effort, you know, by a young man. Jace, Jace did what I, I expected him to do. And I think we all we all knew that he was going to go out there and and uh, give us give us a good nine. So uh, at least give us give us a quality start. And uh, he did just that. And he kept them on their toes. And, and he, he did an incredible job. A plus day at the ballpark. That's it for sports.